So, Mr. Verhofstadt, we finally have a proposal on the table from the Commission for a green paper with options for eurobonds, which you've been calling for for some time. Is this the solution to the eurozone crisis? Uh, finally, we have now a proposal of the Commission. I'm very pleased with it because we already, for two years, have asked for uh, a proposal uh, on, on eurobonds, and, and, and certainly, I think it's uh, the only way to uh, to solve the, the euro crisis because all the half measures. Uh, that has been taken the last two years uh, didn't uh, uh, resolve uh, uh, the crisis. The, the only way forward, the only solution, is to create a, a, a Eurobond market. This is, of course, only a consultation paper. Uh, how soon will, it, uh, will we get an actual legislative proposal, and can we wait that long? Well, we have now to convince uh, the, the, the member states of the Eurozone uh, to accept uh, the uh, proposal of uh, the Commission. And I'm, uh, I'm uh, optimistic because uh, inside the paper of the, of the Commission there is also a proposal uh, uh, to uh, create what we call a European Collective Redemption Fund. It's a proposal by five uh, German uh, economists uh, who are the advisors of uh, Angela Merkel. And, and they're proposing to create a fund uh, to mutualize uh, the, uh, the debt above 60% and uh, to also foresee uh, very bold uh, yeah, uh, reduction uh, schemes, uh, uh, reduction of uh, public debt schemes. So I, I, I'm, I think that this uh, could be a good uh, uh, starting point uh, to, to introduce Eurobonds. Of course, no solution on the Eurozone uh, will, will be possible without the agreement of the German government, which seems somewhat sceptical about these new proposals. How do we convince the Germans to take, uh, take on board? Well, some in, in the Green Paper of the Commission, there is also uh, a proposal that, uh, in fact, uh, uh, picks up the proposal of the five German uh, uh, economists. And there's uh, a, a proposal uh, of the five uh, uh, wise men in, in Germany who is establishing uh, what we call a European Collective Redemption Fund. Uh, that's mutualizing all the debt above 60% of those countries uh, uh, of, the, of the euro uh, who are not using the, uh, the rescue fund, the EFSF. And I think it's a good proposal. It's a proposal that uh, combines discipline and solidarity. And it's made by, uh, by uh, five uh, German economists. So uh, maybe we can go forward with that idea. Does that require a treaty change or can it be implemented fairly well, quickly? Well, uh, the five wise men are saying that it doesn't require a, a treaty change and it doesn't require also any problem with the, the, the decision of the Constitutional Court in Council. So basically you're seeing uh, a step-by-step -step approach to the in introduction of, of various bonds that can gradually fill the space that is necessary to calm the markets? I, I think that is a, a very important first step that we can make based on that proposal of the, of, uh, of the five uh, German economists. And uh, it can also stop the crisis, block the crisis, because uh, I immediately uh, we uh, find a solution for this uh, the debt of countries as Italy, as Spain, uh, Germany, France, uh, Belgium, Austria, uh, all this could be mutualized and, and could be reduced as fast as possible. Thank you very much.